Welcome back. So while I was uh, scrapping the ships we found, um, I found a traveler here. And I got his marker, so we're going to go check that out. Um, I think I got a couple of, I think I got some tech I need to sell. And then we'll be out of here. Let's see. Purchase upgrades, sell, starship. Yeah, sell those. Okay. So I still have... Okay, so that stuff needs to be sold. Alright. Offer trade. Sell. Starship. Alright, go ahead and sell that. And sell that. All right. So let's go see what uh, what we can get from the gray marker. All right. So this is gonna have aggressive symbols as well. So I'm beginning to think all these travelers got killed because of the aggressive sentinels. That's gonna be like a someone trying to sell me stuff. all of a sudden kind of strange all right all right so he don't yeah I got nothing left to say extract technology all right go to the ship All right, got out of there before he got mad. All right, so what did we get? All right, so is this installable? It is. All right, so advanced mining laser. See if they're if we need it on the other gun. Don't really need it on that one. All right. So I sent all the freighters out um, on missions. So the only combat missions I have are the pirate frigates. So if we get attacked, we'll find out if uh, they come and help, or if it's only the uh, combat frigates. All right, we'll go here. All right. So we're still looking for robotic fauna.
don't see anything running in the background. I don't know what. I kind of feel like it's uh, stuttering. I don't know why. Maybe it'll clear up. Freighter, and we'll go, uh, or we'll check for travelers, and then we'll go to the freighter. Any travelers? Nope. All right, back to the freighter. Scan the system. We got a desolate planet, which is probably going to have nothing on it. Um, a radioactive planet. A fungal toxic planet. Um, a swamp planet. A radioactive planet. And copper rusted life. So it's a dead planet. So that one has nothing. That one has six. That one has 13. That one has six, that one has six, and that one has eight. All right, we're looking for planets with two fauna. All right, let's head to the black hole then. I think we're at like 540 something thousand, 540 something thousand light years. All right, here we go. Maybe we can get a uh, combat freighter. All right. We'll take these out. I'm not really concerned about any of the other stuff, so I'm just gonna concentrate on getting down the get the frigate. I want I want the frigates is what I want. down to here Charge up the shields.
Okay, then what did I miss? This one? Oh, uh, missed the ball? Okay. everything. Fog was messing me up. I get the hole down. do one per I have to do one so I'm gonna have to get I'd actually have to get rid of ship uh, frigates to be able to uh, check all of them so which one is it oh that one Spec frigate. Oh, it's a C class. So if I decline that one. Okay, so I have to decline it and then I can look at a different one. Okay. Come on. What's going on? Uh, what 
is going on? Now I can't love that one. Inspect frigate. Akio's future. Future, let's see, decline. So, do we have a different one to look at? All right, so if we head to this one. Frigate. We keep getting the same one. All right. Except. And now I'm full, so I can't recruit anything else. All right. So basically, I'd have to get rid of have five empty frigates to inspect all the frigates to look for like a better class because it's only letting me look at one and I did when I was in normal I didn't have that issue I could go up to each one of them and check them but in survival I only seem to be able to look at one I don't know if that's a bug or if that's just how it's supposed to be but, oh well alright Dreadnought's back up to 100. Alright, so that's bugs. I want to restart. As soon as I fly out of here, I'm going to get attacked by uh, pirates again. Alright, well, let me restart. That bug's back. Okay, and we're back. Alright. I should have cleared the uh, pirates. I'm just going to have to send those two out and until they become an S-Class. Okay. Okay, so we'll just have to send these, send these two out until they upgrade. So, and we'll keep one of the combat ones. So, we'll find out if, uh, if we get attacked by any uh, pirates, if they'll send anything out. So, let's see. Alright, so we got a... Alright, so we got a fungal planet. Or toxic. Um, this is going to be a, a grassy planet. A cold planet and another grassy planet. Alright, so we got 
11 fauna, 9 fauna, 10 fauna, and 7 fauna. Okay. I don't think any, none of them were dis dissonant, right? Alright, well, don't need to do that. Okay, doop, 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 doop. Nope, no, no dissonant. Alright. Alright. Let's proceed on. Okay, so we're currently at 520, so by the end of this one, we should be in the 400,000s. Out of jump range. Come on, select that. No, no, that that one. Nope, that one. I will tell you, you selecting in the galaxy map using the mouse is a hell of a lot easier than uh, using a controller. Closer to the uh, black hole, and we'll call in the freighter. Alright, where's the. Oh, uh... well, it's on the other side. Go ahead and charge that up. Nope, not that one. Alright, so this is a Corvac system. Alright, let's check for uh, Traveler. Any travelers? Nope. Just far back. All right. All right. So this multi-tool should already have. Yeah, it has the advanced mining laser already. So uh, let's see, what did we get? So 15 expedition trade. All right, so we have two trades. So I wonder how many of these we can put in here at a time. So now we have plus 30 on trade, plus 15 on defenses and plus 15 on speed. So we got a lifeless planet, um, a dead planet, a fungal planet, a grassy planet, a boggy planet, and a murky planet. Uh, this is going to be a swamp. So we got 14, 9, 11, Zero and zero. Okay. All right. Looks like we're moving on. Ah, right, here we are. Okay. Head to the black hole. A 
another one? Okay. I think this is one of those systems that always generates a uh, dreadnought. There's the coordinates. So if you want to come check it out, I think this is one that, because we just did a Dreadnought, and it's supposed to be a three and a half hour cooldown. So there are some systems that every time you pop into it, it will have a Dreadnought spawn, or has a higher percentage, and I think this is one of them. So, all right. Oh, I gotta call my freighter in. I had to clear the freighter out, though I couldn't call my freighter in until that one was over and done with. Alright. Let's go see what we got. Uh, this way. This way. Turn around there. All right, so we got a radioactive. We got a grassy planet, a cold planet, a desert planet, and a fungal mold planet. All right, so we got seven. So this is gonna be toxic. Seven. 10, 12, 7. Okay. Gotta come across one at some point. What I didn't check for is a uh, traveler. Let me see if there's a traveler in here. Uh, I think I see a shimmering. Yeah, it looks like there might be one. Yep, there's a traveler. You, you. There we go. I approach the lost traveler. Her skin is translucent as if they are not truly there. The creature, it spoke to me. It saw me, even in space between worlds. And do you know what it did? It gave me a gift, a single piece of paper, a mathematical proof. The traveler offers me a dark, a darkened manuscript, the material flesh-like and almost translucent. Read it. I read the manuscript. It appears to show the mathematical proof that the concept of goodness does not exist. As I read, the traveler stares at me. They ask how we can possibly go on knowing that this is true. I do not know. We exchange gifts. I move on, troubled by what I've read. So 69. Grab my nanites back here. Anything else? All right, let's go see if there's one of those archive things in the back. Or 
we'll see what's in the Atlas room. see what we get this time hello world the atlas has created a simulation of its own world its entire existence in an attempt to witness its own impending death it wishes to show me its past its future perform diagnostic data unavailable Okay. Either we've already got that information or I don't know. That's kind of strange. But there seems to be a lot of strangers tonight, so. Okay. So two part dreadnoughts in a row. Glitch. Alright. So we're five thirteen. Out of jump range. Oh, that was dissonant. Well, we'll go see if that works. Calypso. Planets. Four, four, team, four planets. Two moons, Gek. Alright. You know what I did not do? I did not go... I didn't ask for the... Uh, Hop back to the last system. I forgot to ask, or forgot to get the uh, marker. All right, let's see if there's one here. Oh, there's another traveler here. I approach the traveler. Their skin translucent as if it's not truly there. Don't you understand it? Why we cannot meet. Why we find only hollow echoes of corpses. There is only one of us for each iteration. A single traveler sent out to explore its vast creation. That we are speaking at all. That, that the boundaries have crumbled as much as they have. It should fill you with terror, not with hope. Suggest that it was meant to happen. I suggest that it was meant to happen, even if the travelers have been alone so far. Perhaps we were always meant to find each other. Perhaps this breakdown is for the best. The travelers hope hopes that I am right. They give me a gift for the dark times ahead. So nanites. All right. So we're going to get his. All right. So now we have his grave marker. All right, so instead of going back to the 
the freighter. Right now we're going to go back to the previous system. And then we'll come back to the freighter. Not what I wanted to do. It does not like me to talk to you. Wow. Hey, what's going on here? Yeah, so I can talk to you. So are you not really here or something? Is there another one over here? Okay. That's weird. Because I didn't get the gray marker. Oh well, okay. That dissonant ship's not looking too good here. That didn't work. Okay, so we got a hot planet, a cold planet, another cold planet, a grassy planet, a desert planet, and a scalding planet. That was dissonant. All right, so we got eight fauna, eight fauna, eight fauna, seven fauna. 11 fauna and 14 fauna. Okay. Did I not get it because I have one in this system? I don't know. A lot of strangeness. Let's go. go do the dissonant ship and then we'll uh, go check out the grave marker. Stuff out of the barrels, wheel barrels. All right, got the dark gun. Harmonic lockdown in progress. Scan memory registers. So we have one, seven, and thirteen. Input overwrite glyphs. Yeah, one, seven, 
13. Deactivate multi tool. And then locate this in a spike. weapon we got here a C class with a with one uh, supercharged spot okay. It's going to take more, longer than I want it to. black and yellow starship starship exosuit all right let's see what happens crossing fingers hey it worked Get our brain. Harmonic brain. Is that the wolf from Red Riding Hood? <laughs> All right. Back to the ship. Starship. All right, so this is a B class with two supercharged slots. Compare, claim. All right, so this is what it looks like on the inside. Go ahead and take off. All right, so you don't really have much obstruction if you like looking at if you like driving in the cockpit. All right, so bring up the sun. So there's the back. There's a side view. And 
there's the front. Okay. And there's your coordinates. Okay. Land this puppy. Alright, let's go check out the uh, raid marker. What a bad looking ship. It was like uh, another plant or another uh, another moon. Uh, this one doesn't look like it has uh, aggressive sentinels, so we don't have to worry about that. So what did we get? The C radiation. Yeah, those are the ones you'd buy at uh, in the anomaly. Okay. I think we're in a uh, black hole system. Yes, we are. Where we end up. All right, we're at five oh five, so we're almost to four, almost about to pass under five hundred thousand. Alright, so where's the base station? So, Corvac alarming and satisfactory. Go in here and uh, go back and scan the system. another traveler so uh, we've had a traveler in every system no I'll talk to you no come on you I approach the traveler skin translucent and not truly there you I saw you there speaking to myself I have been having such terrible dreams I should not have sought the Atlas. I should not have listened to their voices. I'm going to kill again. And when I do, I found, I'll i find you. Blood caked across my exosuit. Flesh within my teeth. I can't stop it. I see this future as if it has already happened. As it, as it will happen. Nothing can prevent it. What can I do? How can I live with this knowledge? Suggest the vision is false. You are kind for saying so, but you are wrong. Take this. I will not be needing it any longer. Not when I am awake. Alright, let's not forget him this time. 
All right, so we got got his marker. There's two in here. So, out of curiosity. Okay. I'm gonna go check the gray marker and then I'm gonna come back and see if uh, the other one will give me one. Probably won't, but we can test it. Raging. All right. Let's see what kind of technology we can get. Correct technology. So let's head back to the uh, space station. And we'll talk to the other one to see if uh, he'll give us anything. be two or there's gonna be one. So there's one there. I approach the traveler's skin is translucent as if they aren't truly there. Hum, it's really you, isn't it? I had to see for myself the dawn of the travelers, the last days of the universe. But don't give up hope. It's said that one of us visited you in the darkest hour and showed you a vision of a future you believe to be impossible. So here I am. I see a vision of my older, of myself, older, undaunted, traveling beneath the stars of an alien world. But I am not alone. There are other travelers with me, more than just apparitions, more than just visitors. One day, we will live together, side by side. There will be no sky we cannot claim, no challenge which cannot overcome. Our universe awaits. The vision ends. The traveler asks me how I feel. Say it inspires you. I say that it inspires me. The traveler grins, claiming that they knew I would say this. They give me a gift from my future self in honor of my past. More nanites. All right, ask. Hey, we got another one. Cool. All right. So we got lucky. Warp here, we'll scan the system, and then we'll go grab that grave marker. So I guess talk to one at a time. That's the trick. Alright, so we got a hot planet, a swamp planet. Um, that's going to be a glitch planet. A bleak planet. So that's going to be a desert planet. That was a big grassy planet. 
another grassy planet. All right, so we got 14, 13, 1, 7, 14, and 6. No, uh, no robotic fauna. All right, let's go get this grave marker. Looks like it might be in a different place. Or maybe not. Oh, it might be the same planet. Looks like the same art, uh, maybe the same one. the technology all right what do we get a shield all right I'm not fighting interceptors The interceptors aren't gonna go down. It's gonna be best bug. They're not searching at all. Alright, I can't summon my ship. Okay. Plan B. Oh, they're searching now? That's the bottom. All right, well, that's going to do it for this one. Till next time. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, hit the like button. Subscribe if you want to see more content. Leave a comment down below. And hope to see you in the next one.